are celebrating 75 years of supporting and appreciating that wildlife that was right in our backyard. Executive Director of the San Diego Bird Alliance, Travis Kemnitz, is here to help us join in on the celebration. Travis, good morning. Good, good morning, to have you here. Yes. We have a San Diego Bird Alliance. What is it exactly that you guys do? Together we defend the region's birds, unique biodiversity and threatened habitats through advocacy, education and restoration. I love birds. Do you? I love What's your favorite bird? I, don't ask me those kind of <laughs> questions. I actually have an owl yeah. that sits in my backyard oh, and I can awesome. hear it. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, and it just makes me so, what? <laughs> don't ask me to do that again. But, but they're, they're beautiful to watch. If you asked me if I would like to be a bird or a fish, I would always say I want to be a bird. I agree, I right? agree, right? Yeah, yeah, no, birds are amazing and birds are everywhere. And so I think that's all it takes to become a birder is just open your eyes and enjoy and take it in. You know, they say sit down and just watch the birds. Like yeah. It's a really good way to relax. So where is the best place if you want to do bird watching? Well, that's a great thing about birding and bird watching is you can do it anywhere. You can mm -hmm. do it from the comfort of your home. I know you guys like to bird in the studio, watching the live cam from, yes, from Big Bear, do. right? Yeah. yeah, so you can do it in your backyard. And San Diego is um, so, so birdy. It's the birdiest uh, county in the nation. Really? With over 520 species of birds that you can find here. It's the most biologically <laughs> rich county in the nation. So pretty much anywhere you go, you can find the birds. Do you need anything to be really good at bird watching or you just sit and watch with your eyes? Start with your senses, okay. eyes, ears, all those great things. But if you want to step it up, you can use binoculars. Oh. You can use spotting scopes. Oh. You can use your apps on your phone like Merlin and eBird. There's plenty of different ways that you can uh, get birding. Okay, let's come over here to Miss Smarty Plants. <laughs> Say, go sit in the backyard and go like look for birds. Exactly. I see, the, I find these in my backyard know, sometimes. Aren't they awesome. Did you see this one? Look what how is that? it is oh, sewn into the reed. This. Come here, look at this. Sewn into the reed. A bird Amazing. did that? Yes, absolutely. Wow. Yeah, weavers or tailor birds. But you had asked earlier, where's a good place to bird? Mm -hmm. Your backyard. Okay. Oh my goodness. And there are so many things you can do to bring birds into your backyard. If you take a look at this, this is dryer lint. Put it outside because dryer look, lint. Yeah, look, birds use it oh, for their birds. Yes. And then you can make these really cute bird feeders. All it is is a toilet paper roll, peanut butter, and bird seed. Put a little stick in it, and it'll bring the bird. Wait, Wait, but what kind of birds? I don't know about what kind of birds <laughs> coming to my house. Wait, are these birds are going to be a problem later? Never. Birds are never a problem. They're the never a problem. Plants, They're never a problem. When they get up on the roof and they start leaving little surprises for us. Well, okay, okay. they may be a nuisance. Okay. But anyway, these are um, things that we're going to have at the event on Sunday. Oh, we love that this. The kids though. can what, make. What a great thing for the kids to do. Exactly. And They're going to make okay. these. And these little birdhouses. These are so cool. Okay, yeah. I mean, there, you see the event there. We're going to talk about it again because I, I would love for everybody to go out and like check this out, uh, especially because guess what you're going to get to see? Heather, you're with Zoo Margo, uh, animal ambassador, and you brought a friend with you. Yes. Why am I whispering? Because I don't want to scare you. Yes, so this is Baby Bird. She is a red crown Amazon parrot. And while originally these birds are from Mexico, there is a strong group right here in San Diego, um, and that flock really flourishes. So this parrot really represents all those parrots that you can actually see here, and you might even get to hear them sometimes. When you hear them, what do you hear? The squawking. Oh, they squawk. Yes. Some people like to complain about them, but when you hear that squawking, you can think about all those amazing birds that are here oh. and helping oh, our see, environment. Did I just hear something from yeah. you? Oh, jeez. Was that you or was that Maya? Both. Oh. <laughs> Maya's talking to the bird, the bird is talking to Maya. And then when, if people come to this event uh, this weekend, do they get to get up close with the birds uh, like this? Yeah, or? so at the event on Sunday, we'll have a multiple group of animals. Okay. And so we'll have all different types. We'll have some birds, probably some mammals, some bugs, some reptiles, and you will get to interact with some of them. We'll see how baby bird is feeling on Sunday, but uh, some of our animals you definitely will get to interact with. Baby we have bird. over 60 different animals 60 at our animals? zoo. 60 animals? Wow. Yes. Oh, mm -hmm. baby bird, thank you for coming and hanging out yeah. with us today. You're really beautiful. Yeah.
really special. Is that Maya again or the bird? That's Maya. Maya, you're confusing me. You're making these sounds and I can't tell who's what. All right, let's get the information up. So if you're into birds or this might be something you want to do with your family, it's happening this Sunday? This Sunday. 11.30, where is it? Liberty Station in the South Promenade. It's a free event. Come one, come all. Uh, and basically we're having a big party. 75 years of conserving uh, nature, protecting birds, and generally just want to create uh, love for nature. And if you love it, you want to protect it. So. Um, lots of, of great activities. Um, we have performers, we have uh, Miss uh, Smarty Plants, we have the animals from Zuvargo. So many fun things to do, this free for the family. family. Yeah, this yeah. Sounds fun. And it's at Liberty Station, so yeah. you know, come on in, enjoy the birds, and enjoy family Liberty fun Station. Event. Very yeah. family fun. It sounds fun. fun. I mean, yes. you're going to be there. Come Absolutely. on. Yes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Click the little scene on top, it'll get you the information if you want to find out more about it. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And hello, little one down there. Thank you. She says thank we'll you. be right back. You're so beautiful.